Area substance abuse experts say the use of prescription drugs by children is a growing problem. Yeah, an older problem becoming younger. This after nine students were expelled from Pulaski High School, and they're suspected of selling prescription drugs such as Adderall to their schoolmates. Seven of the nine are freshmen. Typically, that's roughly 14 years old. Fox 11's Bill Miston takes a closer look tonight at the drug abuse and how young a Green Bay counselor says it begins. I think it's a very uh, legitimate concern to ask how young is the first use of drugs. Barbara Conniff is the director of Libertas Treatment Center, an inpatient and outpatient substance abuse facility. She says drug use among adolescents is still high when it comes to more traditionally seen drugs, but that more and more patients are skewing younger and sometimes starting drug use at the age of nine years old. We're seeing that marijuana remains popular. With teens, we're also seeing an increase in cough medicine and over-the-counter drugs. And we too have noted, you know, prescription drug abuse of the stimulants and other prescription drugs. According to a 2011 survey by the Centers for Disease Control, more than 25% of roughly 15,000 private and public high schoolers asked admitted to having offered, sold, or given an illegal drug by someone on school property. That was a 3% increase for 2009. That same study shows about 20% admitted to using painkillers, stimulants like Adderall, or other mood-altering drugs one or more times without a prescription in 2009. Two years later, that number crept up slightly, and in Wisconsin, about 18% of teens surveyed admitted to misusing prescription drugs. Conniff says that should raise red flags. We are seeing an increase in earlier use and then what that means is that history of use you know is continuing throughout the adolescent years and then into high school she says parents must understand they still play a role in ensuring their medications or their child's are used properly even as um, a child becomes a teenager grows in responsibility that parent wants to allow that child to have a certain amount of responsibility as part of growing up at the same time we as parents are still responsible for the medications. Bill Miston, Fox 11 News. Now, neither the Brown County Drug Task Force nor the Lake Winnebago Metro Enforcement Group were available for comment.